How is it going, everybody? It is I, DB. And Kai. And we are DB Kai Gaming. Welcome back, one and all, to a new episode of Let's Play Tales of Arise. And today, we're going shopping. Hopefully, it's not for unmentionables. But, um, yeah, in the last episode, we made our way to this abandoned ruins that like Shihon opened with her eyes. It probably even dates and yeah, we're gonna go get her some new clothes because she's picky. Place. Sure is crawling with critters. Kind of makes you wonder how they all got in. I forgot how much uh, dialogue it was. Maybe it's a good environment for these species to propagate in. Best not to let your guard down either way. Best not to let your guard down either way. Agreed. I don't know about you. Oh, what do I do? I don't care because now I can say. Nope, it just we just had. But I don't remember God. the last time I felt this full. Do the Renans often not give you all enough to eat? It's never enough. The Renans decide exactly how much we'll have and when we'll have it. And that's that. We do our best to get around it. Everyone has to grow their own food and such behind the Renans' backs in order to get by. Thinking about it now, I wonder if they've always kept it meager so we would never have the energy to try to resist what they've done to us. Yeah. An empty stomach takes its toll on the body and the spirit after a while. How does a Renan like you know what it's like? I may be Renan, but they don't like me either. I could be squeaky clean and they still wouldn't give me anything. Uh, uh. <laughs> Did your stomach just... I didn't hear anything. But you just ate. How are you already... I said I didn't hear anything. <sighs> I still have some I haven't eaten yet. Do you want it? Sure. All right. That was hilarious. Now that I can finally talk again, I know this is the biggest problem is knowing when I can freaking talk. We are going to go into battle. Um, but yeah, if you missed the last episode, please go back and give it a watch. We would appreciate if you could comment and leave a like. And pretty please, could you leave a subscription, you silly little gooses. So, you guys might hear some, uh, what is it? It's like, um, nail Noise gun. It's like a nail yeah. gun. Yeah. I'm trying to remember these. My dad again. is putting up, um boards because he stripped all the wallpaper off the walls in my hall you know as you do well it was like they it was weird wall it was almost like the walls had hair <sighs> looks like we won two dogs <laughs> but uh i always joked and said it reminded me of like the um, get them to the greek you know the, the song he sings at the end uh life hands you a jeffrey stroke the furry walls Stroke the furry walls. So I always joked. Okay. Is, is that I have my own furry walls for when, if I were to ever get really messed up on something. No, I don't party like Attack. that. Attack! I'm too... I guess I'm not too old for that type, but I just... I'm not that type of person. Like this be easy. There, not a partier. Never oh, have been. I honestly... Forward. Didn't really go to any high school parties because everyone I graduated with was into really bad stuff. So yeah. Let's see. I gotta still try to remember these. Excuse me. I burped. He burped. It's that ginger beer. I think it's such a weird beginning to a game. All yeah. right, we got a slave, and then we got a rebel. And then he escapes from the mines. He makes it to the Crimson Crows hideout. And he's going to fight in the revolution. But before he can do that, he's got to go shopping for some new clothes. <laughs> As you do. We got to go around this way. It's like, girl, can you just wear something? I mean... No. No. I know. Leave it leave it to a, you know, fashionistas that wanna have their own digs and dreads. Diggy diggy. Oh, we got something. Apple gel. Alright, so apple gel 
is very helpful. It is basically your, so to we compare this to another game, it's your now. potion. Can we give up already? How oh, dare you tired. compare it to another game? Something all right. I'm not so, until in most Tales games, She's really um, Apple Gels will recover clothes. about 30% of your health. Um, usually it goes Apple Gel, then Lemon Gel, um, and Boy, then... It, it, it's changed, but it used to be Apple Lemon Miracle, but now it's like Apple Lemon, I believe, Grape. And then on the other side, for like your technical like magic points, it's an orange gel, pineapple gel, and then I think a melon gel. Um, but you know, they heal like your health and your TP or your magic. Yeah. By the way, guys, um, we're probably going to start talking a little bit over the dialogue. There's if, just so if, much if dialogue. If that upsets you, Let's please leave a comment and let us know if you want us to be quiet. But um, please do keep in mind that we have no idea when the dialogue is going to happen. So it's really hard for us to anticipate when to stop talking. Plus also, if we're like in the middle of like an idea or a sentence, we like... We'll, we'll forget. Yeah, like I was listening back to the episode um, where you were saying, I know that our character has a helmet, but he doesn't sound muffled. The other ones have muffled voices, and I was trying to tell you something, and of course, all the cutscenes happen, and then I completely forget. So, I understand if you don't Is like it, but please technology? just understand there's so much. If we like just stay song. quiet the entire time, we would not talk at all. Normal. Now, it, I do enjoy that they do have it, but for commentary, it's not friendly. It's not. And honestly, again, since we're playing this blind. But there is a cutscene. The former owner's old wardrobe. Yeah. Get it. I wonder how long they've hung here. They don't look like they've Can aged I get today. something? Get a cloak. The designs are a little dated, but it'll have to do. Wow. Don't, hey, he. don't peek. Listen, I get it. You care how you look. But we've got places to... He's infatuated. <sighs> What is it? N no, I uh, nothing. Did she get a new gun? We've kept Zephyr and the others did. waiting long enough. We should head back. So Noble I'm, Rose. So I, I, I'm a cisgender male. So um, okay. yes, Let's the female form back. is very You're attractive. Were you that happy to find can a I new get, outfit? Can I, I get an outfit? I want an outfit too. Mm, you don't get an outfit. Ugh. But yeah, guys. Um, I mean, if if you don't like it, I understand. But um, I feel like we just need to talk through if we're talking already because playing this game blind, we have no idea when the dialogue's going to happen. And if we just stop every time they're talking. It's just going to be a rough let's play. Yeah, and I will accept, uh, you know, cutscenes. I'll mm -hmm. stop for cutscenes. Yeah, yeah, same here. But if we're just like, advancing, but the side dialogue they have yeah. in the game. Since I brought back up the um, the helmet, so um, what I was going to tell you is, uh, in Goblin Slayer, the main character has a helmet, and what he said, the actor, his name is Brad um, Brad Hawkins. He says literally, he held a bucket in front of his mouth and then spoke through the bucket. Yeah. So that it would give off the effect of him talking through a helmet. So it's very possible that the characters that have like a weird muffled or like metallic voice from the helmets could have used a similar thing. And then our main character here, they probably just had him re like record normally with nothing <laughs> altering his voice yeah. or in the way of it. I heard a Zoogle. I'm just kind of, no, there's a armadillo face. Oh. I'm just running away from him. Don't really want to battle. Uh, okay, so you can't run away. Just keep in mind, 
Tails games can sometimes be very notorious for their difficulty spikes. So, Did I just run in circles. I just just run in circles. be careful from running from too many battles. Yeah. I mean, trust me, I played some of the the older Tails games, and my God, the difficulty spikes are ludicrous. Like, there'd be times I'd be like, I'm doing good, I'm leveling up enough, and I just go fight a basic enemy in a new area, and I get killed. I'm just like, what if I just leveled up five times? How much more leveling do I need to do? I'm trying to remember how we see the um, the, the mission. The map? You know how we have, like, quests? Yeah. Try to see where we can find those. Um, I think, like, if you press, like, one of the trigger buttons, it'll just tell you what you need to do. But you it's not going to show you what it is. Nope, it's not you. It's a supply I... depot, right? I wonder what it actually is. Who knows? I'm skipping that. Oh, come on. Don't skip the skits. I, I had to. That's, dude, that's, Return. That's a taboo for me. All right. I don't want you to skip those. Well, I'm figuring something out. I pressed the wrong button. You're you're, you're doing you're getting to a cutscene, so you've done what you need to do. I'm getting into a. Uh, Want to get town. back to Ulzebek? Yeah, we better. We don't have time to waste. Someone's in a hurry. Ooh, fast travel. Hey, there we go. I love that they've introduced it so early in the game. Because sometimes I... it comes in, like, the middle or late, and I'm just like, why wasn't this in the earlier game? Yeah. There we go. So just go back to the village. It makes it so much easier because you don't have... We don't have to spend time running through the world, which some people love doing. But for, We've you know, our let's play. Let's play. You don't want to spend 20 minutes running through. Sorry, drink break. Okay. I'm pretty uh, sure we just have to go and report back to the guy. Which guy was it? Well, he was an NPC, so. I see the star. I feel like somebody's. Yeah, I don't know, but Crap. someone's there. Oh, it's. Uh, Zephyr, we've got a huge <clears throat> problem. Something bigger than an, than our attack on Balsack. Balsack. Castle. Uh, because I don't have time to worry about anything else right now. Yes, bigger than that. The Bright Eyes, they've started massacring folk all over Cale Caleglia. Just give it your best try. Caleglia. <laughs> what? I don't know. That's not how you pronounce it. <laughs> Calaglia. <laughs> I think it is Calaglia. Yeah. Uh, I, I think, it's, if I remember correctly. They must be after her ma master core. I uh, guess the enemy must be getting serious about retrieving it. They must be if they've, they're willing to kill the slaves. They need to harvest astral energy. Uh, Mosgul? Mosgul? Yeah, let's go with that. Mosgul? Mosgul. Mosgul. Uh, got hit real bad. Wait. I'm going to say that's some, some No that way! Out. These guys are terrible at pronouncing these words. I, I am. Uh, positive. It's the closest town to where we attacked them earlier. I feel bad for <sighs> our people, but them's the bricks. Uh, actually, you couldn't have said bastards instead of damn it. <laughs> you had to say two words? Just where do you think you're going? You do know where. You going? Moscow. What good is it going to do to... I don't need your permission. <sighs> now, how do I get there? Try the map. Try the map. Try the map. Try the map. Try the map! Try to remember the map. It's not that one. Nope, that's a screenshot. Sorry, guys. We have not played this game in a couple of weeks, so I have apologies. There we go. It's square. Uh... Is there a different map? View display map. 
Yeah, that doesn't really tell me. You probably had to go back the way you originally came from in the beginning of the game. Is that where we started? Yeah, because it's, it's close to the original place. Okay. I wish they gave you... Uh, stars near the exits you need to go. Now, from here, I don't know where you go. Well, no, that was from, uh, Xeon Mine. Uh-huh. So. Unless I have to go back through Xeon Mine. No, we, we rode the train there. Yeah. So. Make your way to Mogul from Kyrd Garrison. Kyrd. Kyrd. Wasn't that one of the holdouts that we were in? Sure. <laughs> I'll just keep heading this way. I think you just just keep going this way. Ah, uh, well, we're fighting. Get lost. You're mine. I thought we left you. I thought she hung up left behind. No. Which it's done. a blip on our radar. I doubt it's this way, but. You'll know. The game will tell you. Well, this might be edible out. We'll find out if we wasted our time. Could have used the campfire to fast travel. Life bottle. So that will revive a party member when they have been KO'd. Yeah. Gotta get away from you. Got some zoogles. I right, just said wolf. Way. Oh, Gollum. Good old Gollum. Brings back memories of Tales of Symphonia. I give apple gel. Got the uh Thank you. This is why you grind, Caden. We're going, we're going, we're going. I just got This is why you gotta level up. There we go. I killed it. We won. Stone fragment. 
this way or is it that way? I'm gonna assume this way. mine tunnels we'll see if you go the right way I don't know but one of these times I'm gonna to have to uh, cook something again my food bar is less than 50 don't know what that means but my food bar is less than 50 I don't know either I think it's certain effects or something Oh, well, yeah, there are certain effects. Um, like, you'll get, like, like for the next three battles, your attack will go up, or, you know, or defense for enemies will be lower, you know. That's probably what it is. A certain amount of time. Yeah, or, yeah, yeah. Until, like, you have to re-cook and, you know, basically do it again. Gain those back. Yeah. Uh, Zoogle. It says wolf, but Zoogle. As I press the wrong button. Two wolves, level seven. No choice. We have no idea where we're going, people. Rising At least it's not a golem. Yeah. That golem was tough. Well, there's a weak spot on its back, luckily, but. That's something I am not the happiest that they introduced. It's like, oh, there's weak points on enemies now. It's just like, can can I just kill it easily? Barely a no. On our <laughs> Why would you want to kill something easily? So I actually advance in the game without dying? Ah, uh, nah, that's not fun. You only have to die a couple times. Well, in Tales of Zillia 2, they basically made the main character the ultimate... So, like, the, you had three wep main weapons. You had dual blades, a hammer, and guns. Um, so, basically, you were the only one that could damage aerial enemies because the guns were effective against those well, that fly. And then you had a hammer that you could only help, help do, deal damage to armored enemies. Well, I think we went the wrong way. Yeah. Listen, like we have said multiple times in this episode, this is a blind playthrough. We have no idea what we're doing or where we're going at certain points What's of this game. Way? So we probably will get lost a couple of times. Oh, wait. I'm going further in. There's enemies. I'm getting them. Might as well. We're here. Gemini Aqua. I beat you to it. Ooh. I'm trying to think. When was the first time Seems Mirage right was used me. in the game? Was it... Was it in, like... Got some jazz. Zillia or... Vesperia? I can't remember. Uh, oh. I never played any of these. I am going up. Going up. Hopefully, going back. we're going up. The Can right I? Um... I can. Okay. Who is back? We're, we're traveling back to Uzbek. All right. Best well, why we why we do that? I'm going to say. Hold We've on. reached Ready? our destination. And, yeah, well, should, yeah, but um, thank you so much, everybody, for watching this episode. I know this is a very weird place to call it, but honestly, we don't know where we're going. So what we're gonna do off screen is actually find where we need to go. That way we aren't wasting your time. So what did we do today? We went clothes shopping in an ancient ruin and back travel to nothing. Yeah, and it seems like our main character likes Shihon's new look. Yeah. Well, anyways, thanks so much for watching this absolute garbage episode. Hopefully you found something about it fun. 
and hopefully next episode will be a hell of a lot better than this one. Thanks again. See you soon. Bye-bye. Goodbye.